Good morning. A new senior residential club is opening in the Traverse City area. I want to introduce Karen Anderson, CEO of Cordia. Karen, this is uh, near the Grand Traverse Commons, right over at Building 50. That's correct. A very popular spot that we've seen over the years that is being remodeled. New restaurants are going in, new businesses, and the biggest right now, Cordia, which officially opens tomorrow. That's correct. And, and what's special about this too is that it gives seniors in the area a, a kind of a unique and, and different take on senior residential living. That's correct. Mm -hmm. So we are the last component of the original historic Building 50 to be completed. So that's exciting in itself. That is. And the residential club will house 110 private residences that are located with 30,000 square feet of private club amenity space for our members. So uh, it's a wonderful package of opportunity for our residents and our club members to enjoy and yet we go through a door and we're connected to the Mercado and everything is there at, at our members fingertips. There's a nice convenience factor for the residents. Well it's convenience and it's it's mm -hmm. vibrant it's a vibrant village community that is created there at the Commons and so it's not just convenience but it's being part of a community that is active and engaged and has so many things going on all the time. And what brought about this idea to bring Cordia into the community? Well, I think as the as the commons was being developed by the Menervinis, there was always the hope that perhaps there'd be a residential component for seniors as mm -hmm. part of it. And so this is just the fruition of that of that expectation. And is there a, a certain age limit that you're looking at right now starting at you know, 55 to? It's 55 and okay. over. Um, and so it's for seniors that are in want to be very intentional about the next stage sure. of their life, who want to make sure that they're continuing to lead a life that is purposeful and has meaningful and interesting pursuits. And so the club is there to support them. We have, again, 110 private residences wow. and yet 30,000 square feet of club amenities, which include two dining spaces, a club dining room and an, an informal pub, a fitness center, a spa and salon, a library and computer center, billiard center, a 50 person theater. So it's, uh, it's all right state there of the art. It's all right there. It's all right there. If people would uh, or they're interested in trying to get more information, is it best to go to the website uh, is, uh, or come to the open house when everything officially we have, opens? We have uh, two open houses this okay. weekend, uh, Saturday and Sunday, both from 12 to 4 p.m. Everybody is welcome to come. So whether you're a senior or not, or whether you're just curious about what we've been doing for the last 13 months during construction, please. Please come 12 to 4 p.m. Saturday and Sunday, or you can go to our website at CordiaTC.com. Excellent. Karen, thank you very much. I will post all of this information on our website, upnorthlife.com, so you can have those specific dates. Thank you again. Thank you. Nice.